The U.S. is ready to roll out millions of COVID-19 vaccines for children under five years of age once the FDA grants emergency use authorization. The FDA's Vaccine Advisory Committee is going to meet next week to go over trial data and to make a recommendation on whether the vaccine would be appropriate for young kids. The CDC would then have to sign off. The CDC says 10 million doses of the Pfizer vaccine will be available and ready to go. A fourth COVID-19 vaccine could also hit the market soon. Doctors say that it takes a more traditional approach to fighting the virus. KMBC 9's Alan Shope explains how this new one is more like a flu shot. It uses a protein-based technology. It's a potentially new COVID-19 vaccination called Novavax. It's different than the current vaccines that we have available. The doctor says the difference is the three current vaccines ask your body to make and develop proteins to fight the virus. Novavax, he says, synthesizes protein. It's a more traditional approach. It's something that's been used in the past for flu vaccine. Novavax is already approved in 170 different countries and has applied for emergency use in the United States. Well, hopefully there will be some people that will hear about it and, and uh, read about it. It, and if they've been disinclined to get the existing vaccines that are out there, that hopefully this one they'll find acceptable. The doctor says another important part of Norovax is that it doesn't need to be stored in extremely cold temperatures. And if refrigerated, the vaccine can last up to nine months. It's something that's more familiar. I think it'll be nice to have yet another option, particularly people who have not decided to get to get vaccinated. If they've had some concerns about the existing vaccine. In Kansas City, Alan Shope, KBC 9 News.